Hi everyone, I just wanted to do a quick um, garden update. It was a request, so I'm going to do one. And we are looking at the tomatoes now. You see how tall they've gotten. They're way taller than me. Oh, well, here's our the purple cone flowers. And you see they're coming out. And then we have, look, tomatoes starting. These must be the cherry tomatoes, but they're all starting, which is so nice. And here's our big ones that are starting. But if you can see, look at how this one is, is tall. Well, almost getting as tall as the stick that he has them tied up to. But if you see, um, where is it? Let me see. hope I'm not making anyone dizzy, but look at all the flowers on this one. We're talking big time tomatoes. Here's more that are starting. The tomatoes and well, we have more here that are growing. Let's see. And another one down there. Let's see. Oh here's the big here's a tall boy I can't believe how tall that one is. So tall. And let's see. Oh, here's some more. So this is all our tomatoes, and they're really, they're sprouting big time. These are the fig trees, and it takes a long time before you're ready to eat the figs, almost like fall. But see, these are the figs. That's how they come out. They're pretty cool looking. But they're like big, like trees now. Put there, let's see if I can get, see, I love how nice and shiny their leaves are, like, let's see if I can show that, there we go, but I'm trying to, here's more that are starting, figs that are coming out, they're poking out everywhere, but they really do, it takes a long time for the figs to mature, to be able to eat them, but that's the figs, and let's see, if I can take a shot, they look like big, just everything's bushed out. So there's our figs. And, oh, and I can't forget, oh, here's a baby fig tree that he just planted. And then our, sorry about that's my little, one of my little ones. And here's our, our mom. It's going to look beautiful. Oh, we even have um, to, that tomato that didn't fit in anywhere else. It's growing good here. Well, actually, two of them are right here. And of course, our the bird feed it a bird feed the birds. And let's see if I can take you over. My bleeding hearts. They're getting too much sun now, so they're not looking too good. Here's those purple cone flowers again, and some some are sprouting. Let's see. If we can show that. They're pretty. And we'll show up in here. There, you can see her. You can't see the babies, though. They must be underneath mom or hiding. Let's see. Oh, well, that's not a very good shot of bum. <laughs> okay. Um, we'll take you over to the other spot. Oh, here's our other um, mom that's growing good. Here's another look at the fig trees. Let's see if I can stand back. They're huge. Okay. Well, we're going to go over here now to this one. And of course, our lettuce is just rampant. I, I found out that we have like these, all these little rabbits. And I just saw a baby rabbit actually in these, this lettuces. And I wanted to get a picture or even a video of him, but he skedaddles. He's hiding. So, well, that's a Swiss shard. And I think this is kale or something like that. Here's our broccoli, and it's finally sprouting. The broccoli is finally sprouting. You see that? There's our broccoli. There's a more lettuce. That thing is huge. Um, here are our let me stand back. This is the cucumbers. I can't believe everything has gotten so out of control. Um, well, I gotta be careful. Some oh here, I can show you. See, there's a, oh, 
There's a little baby cucumber starting. And I think, where else did I see there was a cucumber? Little baby cucumber starting somewhere. And here's another one that's starting. Oh, there's another one in there. You can see it with the... There we go. See, so we got cucumbers. We're even starting to get um, zucchinis. These are the zucchini plants. And we're starting to get those too. So there's one. I don't know if any of well, the flowers are flowering. And here's his hot peppers. I'm not too sure what this is, but it's growing good. But these are his hot peppers, and it's getting the the flowers on them, so the hot peppers are coming. I don't know if you guys can see that. Ooh, we are getting them. I'm sorry. Here we go. There we go. You can see them. Sorry if I'm making everybody dizzy or seasick. There's another one. And here's kind of crinkly looking. They're funny looking. There's another one. Oh, and here's, that's a nice big one. Okay, so, and these, I don't see any, oh yes, these ones are so cool. They're all, they will turn into different colors. I don't know if you can see, see that. They, they like grow standing straight up. You see them? And those will be all different colors. And these are very, very hot. Extremely hot. They're Chinese tricolors, I believe, that they are. There's more. And where's our bell peppers? We're getting, oh, here's another eggplant. That's an eggplant, which no eggplants have, have sprouted anything yet. But they're getting the flowers. So an eggplant will be coming. Oops, where's my, oh, my son's um, from school, his bean plant. There's his bean plant, and that, look how great that's doing, and beans are starting. Let's see if I can show you. See, there's a little bean starting, so his bean plant's doing really well. And, let's see, oh, these are the same ones that stand straight up. Isn't that cool? There we go. And oh, over here looks good too. I keep seeing all kinds of. There we go. And they will, like I said, they'll all turn. Some will turn different colors. These are all different peppers. And then this one. And all this some kind of her herb. And here's our bell peppers, which are starting. There's the bell peppers. Another bell pepper right there. And these are the eggplants, and like I said, no eggplants yet, but they will be soon. Um, this is actually basil, and it's a licorice basil. And literally, if you go like this and rub, well, if you even taste, like chew a leaf, it will taste like licorice. But if you go like this on the leaf and then smell it, it's so strong of licorice. He got even a cinnamon one somewhere. I don't know where that one is, but here's the eggplants. And these are more some kind of hot pepper, but I don't see anything on them yet. And our rosemary is growing big. And here is our raspberry, well, back up. There's our raspberry bush, but he keeps cutting it down every year, and I think that's why, because there's nothing on it. I mean, the bush is growing, but I don't see any raspberries, so that kind of stinks. And then, of course, our blue spruce that's still doesn't really change. I mean, it's growing, but... So I'll show you a good, the long length of... Let's see if I back up to the fence. There's the garden. Over on this side. And then, of course, if I go over here like that, you see the garden over there. Oh, and there's my son running. So that's it. Oh, you know what I keep forgetting to show, show everybody is... Um, on Father's Day, um, Daddy got a, uh, a cherry tree for Father's Day. And this is what me and the kids had picked out for him. And he planted it over here. No cherries yet, it's just a little baby. But that's the cherry tree. I don't know if you can 
see it better if I back up. That's the cherry tree. So hopefully next year we'll also have cherries. And um, where the doves are, that's our, that's our pear tree. And that's, oops, that's the pear tree. And I actually think we are getting, yeah, we're getting pears off of it now. So there's the pears coming. So we have a whole, like, garden of a whole bunch of different things. There's all the little pears. Well, that one doesn't look too good with a boo-boo. So don't mind in the background um, the little ones. She's always having a fit over something. Um, so one shot of the, the garden, and I'll do a quick shot. All right, John! John! He's not paying attention. Let's see if I can get him. He, he's the man behind all this greenage. Say hi! hi. There, he's... Hi. That's, that's Daddy. Do, he's the one that has all the, the credit for all this uh, greenage and garden stuff. Oh, look, at, he's even shoved basil in here in this little pot. It's just everywhere. Oh, these are our snap peas, which they've had it. Um, even the... The snap peas that are left on it, what he does is he leaves these on so they dry. And then he can use these seeds um, for next year. So we did get a lot of them off of it. But now they've just, they've gone too far now. So they kind of taste really rough and yucky at this point. You might be able to really hunt around and find a somewhat good one. But see, this is how he dries them. He just leaves them right on the, on the thing to just to dry up like that. And then he uses it for... Um, for next year for the seeds because like I said everything in here that you see except for the figs because they go just dormant they lose all their leaves but we just put them in the cellar and um, they're fine but besides those everything that you see in this garden is all um, planted by a seed so it's not bought or anything he does everything by the seeds so um, that's about it um, I hope you enjoyed this video. The last thing is, oh, there's the babies. And this is um, the last thing I'll show you guys. If you can see those cuties in there, see the little babies? There they are. She got two of them. There's the other one. And there's Mama Dove. And that's it for now. So I'll leave that on that note. Sorry with the background noise, but they're having fun and playing. All right, I hope everyone has a good, um, you know, day and night, depending on where you live. Um, hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll talk to you real soon. Bye.